Hi, this is Nalia Deutsch, and today I'm going to show you the layout of Moodle MOOC 24 and Learn to Moodle, which is a course, a free online course for beginners. The course is based on creating videos, showcasing or demonstrating what you learn. In the first uh, video, participants are asked to demonstrate what they see, which is what I'm doing right now. This is a Moodle course with information on the left. Notice what information is here. Information in the center, which coincides with the information on the left. Notice we're in the overview and the blue is the overview. If I go into orientation, notice what happens. It turns blue. If I want to come back up and click on the orientation, it'll show me the same thing. All the information that's here. And if I scroll down, let me close the left and scroll down in the orientation, I will be able to see all the information here. Now, notice the orientation is the topic section. So is the overview, weekly badges, live online meetings, open form, weeks one, two, three, four. And the final topic section is a certificate of completion. So whenever we click on any of these topic sections, we will be able to there. Notice I leveled up more about that in a minute. I'll be able to see all the activities and what I have to do. Sometimes the to do is only view and sometimes the to do is an activity where you will receive a grade and a passing grade because everything is graded out of 100 and the only grade you can get is 100. There are no in between grades. Notice also the jump here at the bottom in the middle. I can go back to orientation, the topic section called orientation. There it is. I can jump from one topic section to another by going into jump. I can also go at the bottom to the right or the left sections from the center. This is all in the center or at the top. Notice the overview is before there is an arrow pointing to the left. And on the right is weekly badges, as you can see, after the orientation. So that's the center. On the right, that goes with the left, which is called course index. Okay, that's the left with a course index. On the right, notice it's open block drawer. This is where we have blocks, the latest announcements, upcoming events with the server's time zone or my time zone, which is... Toronto or New York time. If you want your time zone and please go into your profile and make sure that you get your time zone and save it so that what you will see here is not my time zone. You'll see another time, but we will all be able to connect in this live Zoom meeting at the same time. These are the activities. Notice if you go into the forms, you can subscribe to them. So let's go into the form. I suggest you subscribe as I have to all the forms. Okay, right now I have them to all the forms. I'm in as a student, as a participant right now. How do I get back here? I go into the blue. Everything under the blue is part of the course. So let me click on the blue. I can also go to the course index and go from one section to another in the middle in the left and that corresponds to the middle. Notice what else is here? Completion progress. Notice I haven't done anything. Some of the activities are just view and some are where you have to do something. The first one is just view. So all I need to do is to view. Notice done view. I have done this. Let me go back now into the course and scroll down once again. Notice now it's ticked off and the color has changed from royal blue to a light blue. And this is how you go from one section task to another. So make sure that you complete everything so that you can get your final certificate. And of course, 
digital badges. Your badges, this is the level up. Every time you do something, you get points. And notice this is your progress, how much you have done. Your latest badge will appear here. Notice I don't have one yet, but yours will appear faster than mine. Right, so thank you very much for watching this. Let me close the right block so we only have the center and we are not disturbed. If you have any questions, feel free to add them in the comment box below and enjoy moodling.